This is GTA Technology here to show you how to make a simple adding program or counting program. You can add, subtract, double, get the opposite, and reset. Let's go ahead and get started. Open up Xcode and make it a view based application for iOS. I'm going to call this tap counter. Alright, let's go ahead and get to it. On the dot H, go ahead and state or er, um we're gonna actually need a thing a variable for the counting. So this gets stored somewhere. So every time we do this it has it uh a variable to add on to or to subtract from. Okay, so integer count semicolon. There we go. That means that we have a variable that we can add and subtract from, double, etc. Okay, under interface, go ahead and uh, type IV outlet UI label, and we'll call this number. Okay, so now we have a label named number, so we can refer to that later on in the coding. Let's go ahead and state the actions that we will be performing, which, as you can see here, is adding, subtracting, reset, double, and opposite. So dash space parentheses IB action and parentheses add. Now just copy that, paste it so that there's five of them, change the second one to subtract, third one to reset, fourth one to double, and fifth one to opposite. Okay, now go to your .m file. And under implementation, type dash parentheses IB action and parentheses add bracket enter key. That will automatically close it off if you are on Xcode 4. If not, you need to close that off with the closing bracket. Copy this again, paste it four more times. So you have five total. This one will be subtract. This one will be, as you can guess, double. This one will be. <coughs> Oh, sorry, this one will be reset, doesn't really matter. Double and opposite. Under add, you're going to type count plus plus semicolon. This will add one, one the number, to the uh, count variables of count is equal to five, since you, if you were to have added onto it earlier, this will add an one to it. So let's say count is 5, then this count plus plus is basically 5 plus 1. It's just a quicker way of writing that. Or count plus 1. Okay, now we're going to type number.text. So we are referring to this. So we have a way of displaying the number, not just uh, keeping it hidden in the coding. Number.text equals bracket. Uh, I'm not quite sure what type of bracket this would be called. NS string, uh, string with format. Go ahead and press the enter key if you want to jump to this. Uh, at sign, quotation mark, percentage sign, I, uh, quotation mark, bracket, semicolon. So copy this and paste it into each one. There we go. We have five of that now. For subtract, replace the plus plus with minus minus, which as you may guess will subtract one. Reset, count equals zero. That way we are making the actual um, variable count and we're setting it back to uh, zero. Double will just be count times two. So count equals count times two. For the uh, multiplication sign, you will use an asterisk. For opposite, you will do count equals count plus or minus count times two. So that's pretty simple. Uh, so let's say count is five, that would be uh, five minus uh, 10, which would give you negative five. Let's say it's 10, 10 minus 20, which would be negative 10. There we go. That is all the coding that we will have to do. Go to your nib file. 
go to the utilities menu go to objects and drag in a label uh, make the font 82 uh, bold drag out the label some center it there we go and then center the text make the text say zero pull out a round rectangular button try to make it a uh, equal in height uh, with and height okay this one will be plus after you do that click on it and press command D four times so that you have five total let's go and make the top row which as you know is plus minus reset and the bottom is double opposite so let's go and align this the alignment system in Xcode 4 is perfect okay hold the shift key to select multiple items and there we go drag out to select all five of them and center it middle one should be subtract third one should be reset fourth one should be double fifth one can just be abbreviated as opos period okay now right click files owner in the left side drag number to our number drag add to the add sign click touchdown for all of them so double touchdown opposite reset and subtract we are done believe it or not you can uh, change the background color if you think gray is a little bit too uh, depressing and I'll take offense to that go ahead and rise it up a little bit or um, on this little color bar and then raise it up sorry and there you go press run press the plus sign holy crud what did I do wrong I am so sorry okay right here you add comma count paste that in each of these right here right after the quotation mark now it will magically start working I apologize for that okay plus get 10 press opposite you get the opposite double get 20 subtract reset you can go into the negatives and there you go please rate comment and subscribe and expect plenty more Xcode tutorials as I discover more things I'm just as new as you may be